to our big story right now. Hurricane Florence bearing down on the Carolina coast. Some areas have already been dealing with hurricane force winds for hours now. And you can see that storm surge leaving streets and homes underwater in that video behind me. And with the storm now slowing to a crawl, this is only the beginning. Eric Sandoval is right in the middle of all this in Wilmington, North Carolina. And Eric, Troy just said it. You are seeing the worst conditions there. What have you been seeing? Actually, the wind has really picked up. And I keep looking over here, Justin, because I think... An awning or something was just ripped off a building, and we keep hearing it dragging down the street, so I want to make sure me and my photographer are, are safe. You can see the wind is really kicking up the rain, and the rain is just really torrential right now. Woo! If you're just joining me right now, uh, all morning we've been showing you these down trees here in the downtown Wilmington area, and we've been waiting for this other tree just to topple over. Fortunately, nobody was injured in that. We're talking about the awning. Yeah, it's an awning. It's just hanging on for dear life over here. But uh, talking about the awning, but there's also been signs that have been tossed around here in the downtown area. So we've been really trying to stay in these little alcoves of these buildings over here to protect ourselves. The other big story right now is the power outages. Uh, we've been seeing the power flicker here in the downtown Wilmington area all morning. We've been seeing the light, uh, the sky light up with the transformers exploding, the purple, the green. Now downtown Wilmington is completely without power, and you can see why with these high winds and torrential rain. We're going to be uh, continuing to... to bring you these images all morning here on News 6, and of course, we're going to try to keep safe at the same time. For now, we are live in downtown Wilmington, North Carolina, tracking Hurricane Florence. Eric Sandoval, News 6. Back to you. Eric, thank you so much for that live report. Unfortunately, all indications are that the damage will be bad up and down the coast. This is video from Topsail Beach, North Carolina. Water was already rushing into buildings before sunset last night, even knocking down some walls. Some gauges overnight recorded storm surges of more than 10 feet. And let's give you one more live look as Florence roars ashore. We are keeping a close eye on this. We'll bring you updates as we get them both on air and on clickorlando.com.